Welcome everybody to the Victoria Parks Freemasons Open Day. Today is a day of enlightenment whereby the preconceived notion and misconception about Freemasonry will be illuminated on by the intellectuals who are here to guide the public and make the public know what Freemasonry is all about. We've got here the Grand Master of Freemasonry Western Australia. Thanks Tony. My name is Peter Kerwin. I'm the Grand Master of the Grand Lodge of Western Australia. It's a position that lasts for three years and I've been here nearly 12 months so far. Freemasonry is a fraternal organisation for men and those that believe in a higher being and are willing to get involved and work in friendship and harmony and look at charity and have good principles and morals behind them. You basically have to be 18 years old and we are always looking for people to come and join us. Freemasonry does a lot of work in the community. We raise a lot of money via Freemasonry. We run time at villages, we have hostels, we're about to start a 200 bed dementia hostel in Middle Swan and we do a lot of things in the community. We make donations to the Fiona Wood Foundation, Alzheimer's Association, we sponsor things like Tournaments of the Mind for young primary school children. We do Speak Up Awards for younger children. We sponsor Med and Shed. We help emergency services. We help the community when there's disasters, like the fires at Yarloop and Harvey and Esperance. We make donations directly to them. So this happens every year. And each individual lodge also helps out different community groups, like uh, women's refuges sporting clubs, local primary schools, surf clubs, anything that people need help with, Freemasonry want to get involved with. My name is Frank Hayes, I'm a past Grand Master of the Grand Lodge of Western Australia. Uh, the Square of Compasses, which is our symbol, is emblematical of what we are. And we meet on the level and we part on the square. When the door of a lodge is closed, all therein are equal. Some of our ceremonies and some of our beliefs are founded on uh, traditional things that have gone down through the ages, but uh, in today's society we turn to a more modern situation, That's uh, we're involved in communities. You can be any religion you like because we're non-denominational. Our motto is to make good men better and we have a, a credence that goes like this. Freemasons believe that family comes first, employment comes second, and Freemasonry takes a third base. King Solomon is, because of his work in building and dedicating and completing a temple to the work of God, what transformed from that is the different grades of workmanship and masters that came out of that. We're not actually active Freemasons, we're symbolic Masons. We work on symbolic syndromes from the past that represent what we believe in. And it's not a religion, but it's a philanthropic society of men who work within the community to make it a better situation for everybody, not just for Freemasons, but for all of our people. So I think that's about the, probably the best way of explaining it. My name is Paul. I'm a member of Old Goldfields Lodge and J.F. Walter Day Lodge. I've been in Freemasonry since 1980. So in the last 39 years that I've been a member, I've been in Kalgoorlie and I've been in Perth, I've been in Wandawi. During our ceremonies, we learn all sorts of things that help us to become better people. And over a period of time, after having been the Worshipful Master, people at Grand Lodge decide that you can help them with their things, so you get to join the Grand Lodge team. And in due course, you work your way up that particular ladder. In my case, I've had the privilege of being a deacon, a district grand inspector of workings, a junior warden and a senior warden for the Grand Masters of the day. As a warden, you represent the Grand Master, so you pass on his message to other people and you encourage them, you educate them, and you make sure that they understand what Grand Lodge is doing. Uh, I've enjoyed Freemasonry, it's been a magical 39 years for me. My children have helped me, my wife has helped me, and life is pretty good. I uh, joined Freemasonry four years ago. When I first started, you know, I didn't, didn't really know that much about it. Growing up, you know, you hear conspiracies and you hear all the, the online talk about it. Since I joined, it, it's been really good. It, it's completely different to what I expected. Just nice people. Everyone's inviting, you know. I came along to the, when I first joined, I didn't know anyone. So it's given me a real self-confidence boost. Experience in public speaking, a great thing that I've done. I've, I'm more than happy that I've joined. As we all can see, we've gotten interviews from the Grand Master and the former Grand Master and they have told us what the Freemasons do. 
what it is about and where they derive their strength from. It's Tony ETC reporting for Undercurrent WTV.